today I'm going to be talking about why Bandcamp sucks. So it's Sunday now. Oh, I just got a message on Facebook. Newsflash guys, um, I know I'm not wearing my glasses. Um, the main reason why is because my glasses are broken and I have to get them fixed so I'm not wearing my glasses right now so I can barely see anything at all. So, you know, that's really helpful when you're tossing a six foot metal pole. I know I forgot to update a vlog on Saturday. I had a lot of fun stuff I was doing yesterday. I went to a band party. I was hanging out with friends. My apologies. This is something that goes on a hose. Don't know why I'm holding it. Now, for those of you who do not know what band camp is, band camp is basically when um, you are in a marching band and the entire band gets together and they rehearse for their halftime show and their pregame show and they learn their marching and etc etc. Well, I'm just going to be talking about why it sucks because it really does suck. Here are a few reasons why. First off, the re main reason my band camp sucks is because it's always like a bajillion degrees every time band camp starts. At one point, it was like, oh, this is not too bad, you know, 80s, summer temperature, whatever, it's all good. Band camp comes around, and then it's like 100 degrees every single day. We're all outside all day long on this field, marching around. I'm in color guard, so I mean, obviously, like, I don't have it as bad as the band players. Band players, when they play, they're blowing through their instrument, so they're all like, <sighs> trying to make all this noise and stuff with, you know, playing their instruments. I play clarinet, so I know how it feels to march and play at the same time. The sun is beating down on them. We only get water breaks like every hour. It's ridiculous, okay? I'm in color guard. I don't, I have it less bad than other people. I don't have to blow through my instruments. So I'm not hyperventilating every second. My flag, if, I mean, I've used it in a couple of my other videos, like my flag, like, you know, the silk, the flowy part. I could just use that as my shade and just be like, ah, oh, thank goodness. It's hot out all the time. So you're like dying of heat stroke because it's so hot out. But yeah, I'm drinking beer, guys. It's official. I'm an underage drinker. <laughs> no, I'm not. I, I, forget what I just said. This, this is pink lemonade, if you couldn't tell. A while ago, I was over at a friend's house and this guy, we were like on, if you have any of you ever heard of Omegle, um, we were on, on Omegle, and this guy, like, we were drinking raspberry lemonade, which, you know, it's, like, slightly darker than this. It's not, like, uber darker. But this guy was like, oh, are you guys drinking blood? Yes. We are drinking pink blood. That's extremely watery and doesn't, you know, stay in our mouths. We're drinking blood. So, I'm drinking blood out of a beer cup, guys. Anyway, back to why band camp sucks. We have to have sectionals all the time. And for some of you guys out there, you know, color guard is like the palms of their high school. Like color guard is really awesome and they have a lot of funds and all that kind of stuff for color guard. Our school, color guard really isn't like it's it's almost underappreciated. I wanna say that, you know, they completely ignore us. We're doing our own thing. Our, um, my director, his name is Mr. Goodman, and we'll be outside. And he'll be like, okay, okay, band, go to chart three. We're going to start at measure 12. It's like, wait, where is that? I call, hello. I'm, and then I, somebody has to be like, Mr. Goodman, what chart is that? Or what part of the song is that from Color Guard? Because we have no idea where we are. And another thing that sucks about band camp is that it's re like ridiculously long. I lied, okay? Actually, some band camps go for like the entire summer. Like, our band camp at my high school literally is like... It's, it's a week, like a week, and we have two days, like Monday and Tuesday, so tomorrow and then Tuesday I'll have band camp. But it's like from 8 in, 8.30 in the morning until 4 o'clock in the afternoon. So it's like during the hottest part of the day. I wouldn't care if we had to march like, like in the afternoon, like from 2 to like 8 or something like that, because then it's like the same amount of time frame, it's just like the hottest part of the day is pretty much over, and then it's getting cooler and stuff. So I really wouldn't care if we had to march in that kind of weather. Why do we have to march in the hottest part of the day? 
the director's always like, oh, it's not that bad, just put some sunscreen on and drink lots of water and you'll be fine. I think every single one of our guard members, either one, were wimps, or two, almost all of us, including myself, have nearly passed out. So, obviously that says something that it's too hot for us to be outside. No, you guys are fine, just stay out here another 10 minutes or so, you'll be okay. If somebody's gonna pass out, we better go inside, okay? Just, just as a thought process. I don't know why I just did that. Anyway, back to why band camp sucks. It just is awful. Like, I, there's no words to describe why band camp sucks. Band camp sucks. It just does. But yeah, I just, uh, wanted to share my opinion of marching band and band camp and just tell the world about it. Comment in the comment section below um, to comment about what I should talk about next Saturday. It could be about stuff in the news, it can be about pop culture, it can be about anything. I don't care. Follow me on Twitter at Omnubis. Add me to your circle on Google Plus, Aubrey Nelson. Ask me questions at Ask Omnubis. You guys, I check it out all the time. Just ask me anything. It could be like, hey, what is your middle name? And the email is obnubis at yahoo.com. The Facebook page is coming soon. I will see you next time. Adios and thanks for watching. <laughs>